Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of What Not To Render, where I try and highlight the common mistakes that I see in my Maxwell Render Mentoring lessons at the University of Brighton. Today I'll be looking at not introducing a camera into your scene. This is the scene that I'll be working with today, and as you can see, there are no cameras in the Cameras Manager. And the situation here is that someone has come along, made their model, brought it into Maxwell Render, but they haven't added a camera. They've just come in with the model and the materials, navigated around the viewport to find an angle that they like, and clicked Render. And this will be the result that they get. And they find that the exposure is quite low, but that doesn't really matter, because in Maxwell you can adjust the exposure afterwards. Just simply adjust the ISO slider and refresh. And there we go, that will be the image that they save. But that's not really what you should do. What you should do is add a new camera to your scene. There's a variety of ways of doing this. You can go to Camera, New Camera. You can use Shift Command C. You can right click in the viewport and select New Camera. Or my main way that I use is right click in the Cameras Manager and select New Camera. That way you can select the new camera and quickly double click it to activate it. And then you can come down to the Optics section of the camera parameters, set up your focal length to something sensible, say 50, lock the exposure, put the EV number down to something sensible, say 9, set the f-stop to something sensible, in this case let's say 16, and critically of course, adjust your sensor. For this, let's imagine I'm going to use this image in a presentation, and I know that the resolution I will need is 1280 by 1024. I'll make sure the aspect ratio is locked, put 1280 in one side, unlock the aspect ratio, put 1024 on the other side. Then you can adjust the image to what you want, and then right click in the viewport, select focus to, and select a part of the image. And then you definitely know that your camera is set up correctly. Not adding a camera to your scene is what not to render. Thanks very much for watching. Any questions or suggestions, leave them in the comments below, or email me at maxwellrenderbrightoncdt at gmail.com, or tweet me at jcolman underscore design. Thanks very much. I'll see you again soon.